Hey everybody, my name is Chris. Welcome to Casual Fragrances. Hope you're having a great day. If you're new to my channel, welcome to my channel. On this channel, we talk about men's fragrances and we talk about some unisex fragrances as well. So if you like this type of content by the end of the video, make sure you show your support by clicking that red subscribe button down below. If you're new here, it's like welcome to the Casual Fragrance family. Like the video if you'd like to see more fragrance-related content like this and click the bell icon so you don't miss any future fragrance videos on my channel or giveaway announcements as well. In this video, I'm going to show you my trip to Nordstrom. I'm going to show you the new YSOY EDT 2022 release. Um, there was a problem with the original one back in the day, back in 2017, I think when it came out. First started my YouTube channel, which is crazy, right? I think my third or fourth video on my channel, I bought that fragrance. I'll try to leave the card up here or down below. In this video, I'm going to show you how it performs on my skin and how I feel about the fragrance. You should buy it. Or is it redundant? That's it. Okay, guys, I'm back. So I went to Nordstrom in Cherry Hill, New Jersey. Matter of fact, I used to live in New Jersey, not in Philadelphia, uh, on my birthday. Matter of fact. I went a couple weeks ago and I sprayed it on my skin. Did about six sprays. They know me in the store. I go to Nordstrom and buy a lot of fragrances. So I go to Philadelphia as well. So they know me by name now. Nevertheless, um, this is not sponsored by Nordstrom, but I went there, did six sprays on my skin, took a screenshot the time I did it and wore the fragrance throughout the day. And let me tell you, let me tell you how I feel about it. It's the same exact fragrance. They took out some notes. So I looked the note breakdown. It looks like they took out in the original 20, 2017 version of YEDT, took out apple, musk, and it looks like burr fossum. In the new version, we have Obanum. It feels like they've added Obanum to it. And that's pretty much it. I don't see a lot of change in the fragrance. So when you opening, it's very fresh fragrance. It's very fresh. Um, I feel like it's a little tad bit more fresher than the original one. That's pretty much it. The mid dry down smells exactly the same. I'm being honest with you guys. I've had it on my skin for, for a couple hours now and that's it. Um, the newer version I got slightly two hours more than the original. So the original one I got like four or five hours. This one I got like six or seven. So that's pretty much it. They do advertise it lasts all day long on your skin. Everybody's skin is different so please keep that in mind. But for me personally, it's not an eight, 10 hour fragrance. It's about two hours more than what I got with the original one. That's it. And I did six sprays at the store with the actual bottle, not a sample, not a decan. Grabbed the bottle, ch -ch 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 -ch, just sprayed it. They didn't care. You know, I go there all the time, so they know who I am. I sprayed it and I went around, did my day. I could see it projecting a little bit better than the original one. But if you have the original one, I'm going to be honest with you, it's redundant to buy a new one. It really is. Unless you want to collect them all that have, you know, the, 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 the older version, newer version. Great, if you're running out of the older version, 2017 YSLY EDT, then buy the new version, YSLY EDT 2022. That's it. I'm being honest because some people be like, oh, you should buy the new one because it is it is a little bit fresher. That is it. It is the same exact fragrance. You're going to wear the EDT 2017 and the 2022 version in the same scenario. Date night, casual, work, dressed up. There's not a different time to wear. So whenever you wear the original one, you're going to wear the new the reformulated one, that's it. Now your skin chemistry might be different, so you might get an hour, two or three hours more than the old one, definitely try it out, but it's not redundant to blind buy it. If you have the original one, it's not worth it. I'm just trying to save you guys money because I'm a reviewer, that's it. I'm not trying to sell a brand of fragrance so you can go buy it. No, I'm buying fragrance just like you do. And I was gonna buy it myself because I sold my bottle um, to buy more fragrances on my YouTube journey. And I kind of regret it, but nevertheless, I might go back and buy a bottle because I have a $50 gift card I got for my birthday from my uh, fiance's uh, mom. So thank you, Lynn. I do appreciate that. That's pretty much it, guys. It's a simple video. Is it worth buying it? If you don't have the original one, yes. If you have the original one and it's not empty yet, do not buy it. That is it. It's it's very similar. 99.9% .9 similar. Thank you guys for watching this video. I'm sorry I don't have a lot of good news about it. But if you do like this type of content, make sure you search support by clicking that red subscribe button down below. Liking the video and click the bell icon so you don't miss any future video videos and giveaway announcements as well. I'll see you in my next video. Peace.